And you can see that the foundation rows combine the chain row with the stitch row, in this case, the half treble crochet. So this is what you're going to look like, nice springy consistency. Rows, you're going to start with the slip knot. Insert hook and chain two. Because it's a half treble crochet, yarn over, insert your hook into the second chain from the hook. So one, two, yarn over and pull three through. We have three loops on the hook. We first need to make our chain, that's the one, and then we make our half treble, which is yarn over and pull through the whole stitch. Tighten that up and we repeat. Yarn over, find the V, you can just see the V there. So we're going to insert our yarn over and insert our hook underneath that V, yarn over and pull through. Now we make our chain first and then we make our half treble. And again, yarn over, find the V, insert your hook under the V, pull back. Chain one, and then make our half treble. And that's all there is to it. And we continue this process until we've created as many stitches as required. I'll just make a few more. It is a nice way to begin a project um, because it adds to a little bit more consistency and it gives you this lovely springy texture, ideal for the, the start of a blanket or a hat. And just remember when you get to that point, if you give it a little tug, that'll keep your work from having a tendency to turn in. half the foundation half treble crochet